In this video, you will be learning about online shopping and how reviews can help you to make informed purchasing choices while you browse the digital high street. This video is for beginners. Hi everyone, we are One Connect, a social enterprise based in Glasgow, which aims to empower individuals by increasing technology and digital participation. The profits from our organisation go towards running our free IT classes and befriending events in the community. Subscribe to our channel to get notified when we release more helpful videos. Reviews. Reviews can be a really useful way to better understand the quality and validity of the website or product you are looking at. Reviews for individual websites can be more difficult to find, as many do not offer reviews to be left on their website. Most marketplace websites do allow reviews as these websites allow members of the public to sell freely. This is most often a good thing and allows small businesses to thrive, but can also open a door to fraudulent behaviour from those looking to take advantage. In this video, we will go over ways to protect yourself from such behaviour online while enjoying shopping with varied businesses. Where to find reviews? Reviews can be found for individual shops and services on websites like Trustpilot. You can search for a specific website or company. Once you find what you're looking for, you can actually filter the reviews for specific keywords. Here we've used the word quality as an example. This will enable you to find reviews specifically related to any concerns or queries you may have. Reviews on websites like Trustpilot are generally trustworthy and from members of the public, but are not able to be fully authenticated. Websites like Amazon do, however, offer some level of authentication to allow you to know whether the reviewer actually purchased the product or not. Amazon. Below an Amazon product listing, when you scroll down toward the bottom of the page, you'll find customer reviews. Many can be very helpful when deciding if the product is what you're looking for or not. How do you know if these reviews are genuine? Amazon offers a tag on the reviews that reads verified purchase, as seen here. This means that the review has been written by a customer who has actually purchased the product. Though this can be a useful feature, it may not always be as helpful as it appears. Occasionally, sellers on Amazon will merge together various product reviews onto one product to appear as though the product has more positive reviews than it actually does. How can you spot if this is happening? The best way is to simply read the reviews. Does the information in the review make sense? Is it talking about the item you're looking at or something different? If it doesn't quite seem to fit, it's likely a review from another product and not the one you're looking at. Additionally, if you're purchasing a product which claims to be a big brand name from Amazon, it is worth checking the seller name. If the seller is the brand itself, you are buying an authentic product. You can check this beneath the product listing title, as seen here. Amazon may also display an Amazon's Choice banner over the product thumbnail, which means it is both an authentic and popular product. In the case that you do not recognise the product seller, or the product has very little to no reviews, you should avoid purchasing the product and look for it elsewhere, as it may not be legitimate. eBay on eBay, you are likely to find more independent sellers. Additionally, you may also find individuals looking to sell second-hand items. How do you know if these people are trustworthy? You cannot be 100% sure in these cases, but there are some specific things you should always check first when buying something on eBay, be it second-hand or otherwise. First, what is the seller's feedback rating? This can be found on the right-hand side of a product listing. This seller has 100% positive feedback. If you click on this section, you can see how many times they've received a positive, neutral or negative form of feedback. Additionally, you can also see customer reviews. Then you ought to check the listing description, postage and packaging and returns policy. Some items may have hidden descriptions of fault or damage. Additionally, some sellers may load on very high postage and packaging charges. This is something you should check before you buy, though it will come up at the checkout. Finally, make sure you are comfortable with the returns policy. Some sellers will not accept returns and will state this on the listing. So if you are unsure if the product is definitely suitable, you may not wish to go ahead with that seller. Etsy. 
Similarly to both Amazon and eBay, online marketplace Etsy allows you to check seller and product reviews, as well as gives you a description of the product and the seller's policies. A little differently to Amazon and eBay, Etsy sells a good deal of handmade unique items by small independent sellers and businesses. It is ever more important here to carefully check product descriptions, returns and delivery policies, as well as reviews, as you will not be able to verify through the seller being a large or recognisable brand. Remember, while taking into account the information in this video, you should also always do your own research. When in doubt, Google the website or company you are browsing with, find reviews and information on them and make sure you feel safe purchasing from them. Now that you've learned about online shopping and review systems, why not check out our other videos to learn more? You can build on this foundation and learn how to shop online safely and do whatever you want with your computer and the internet. If you like this video, please like, share it and subscribe to our channel. Questions for you. What do you want to learn? What tips will be valuable to you? Please leave a comment below. If you need help with your computer or internet skills, please feel free to contact us.